remember walking into the hospital uh, the first time, meeting service members who'd been blown up, missing their legs, just like Lieutenant Dan. They just went on to talk about the movie. And I realized, okay, you know, that's a way that I can communicate with our service members. They want to talk about the positive story of Lieutenant Dan. In the end, what happens to him? He's standing up again, he's moving on, he's sober, he's married, and he's put his war years behind him. You know, when Lieutenant Dan talks about his destiny, Maybe there was a little bit of destiny in the fact that I would play that character and then that character would become so much a part of the mission in my life of supporting our wounded. And that's what we work every single day to do at the Gary Sinise Foundation for the men and women who serve our country, to try to help them with their journey.